What is up ladies and gentlemen, CJ the Cheese DJ here and today guys we are going over the Armadillo Sucus. Now this guy, oh this, this guy looks awesome as well. All these creature submissions uh, have blown me out of the water. A lot of you guys have done a really good job on submitting these, but let's go over the Armadillo Sucus. So this guy is essentially a gigantic armadillo. Now you can currently see here that there are a couple of different things that we've got. Uh, we've got some abilities, we've got an all-terrain, we've got his look, um, and then the direction that he can roll. So, first off, let's go over it. Now, need something wrecked? The Armadillo Sucus can certainly help you with that. With proper use of its ball form and grappling tongue, it can transform any battlefield into a demolition zone. Or perhaps you just want to travel as a giant rolling ball, which is possible too. Now, its diet insectivore does eat raw meat when tame, neutral but aggressive against wild bugs, and it is rideable. And the saddle will go under its belly, similar to a gacha. So what does it do? It's big, deadly, and swinging right into your house. The Armadillo Sucus is a burly monster who loves seeing structures go boom. By grappling onto a faraway object with its tongue, it turns into a wrecking ball and pivots its way forward, smashing down anything in its path with brutal force. What more could you ask for when you need a pesky wall knocked down? But there's more to the Armadillo Sucus than just structured demolition. Its signature Wrecking Ball attacks works on creatures too, knocks foes away for serious damage. If a creature is big enough, you can even directly grapple and slam into them, which has a cooldown. So you can see through this image, you're able to latch onto them, which I love how it's wrapped around the, 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 the leg, reel into it and then smash it. What more could you want from a dino? Just want to travel? It can do that too. Simply roll and grapple across the map at high speeds. You can even skim across the surface of water if you pick up enough momentum. Or slow down and sink to the ocean floor for some deep sea exploration. Worried about getting stuck on trees or rocks? Well, don't worry as the armadillo sucus will destroy them as it rolls through. Scared of being attacked off your armadillo sucus? Well, also, do not worry about that because the rider is completely concealed inside the ball, but there are counters to this. So... What is it weak to? It is weak to fire. An inflamed armadillo sucus will stop rolling and begin panicking, leaving its rider suddenly exposed. Plant Z or explosives can scare a rolling armadillo sucus and force it out of its ball form. Net guns for obvious reasons and two armadillo sucuses crashing into each other will also stun them both. So how do you tame it? The armadillo sucus loves destroying wars, so why not befriend it by letting it do its favorite activity? Aggro a wild armadillo sucus and let it crash and destroy your walls, and its taming percentage will slowly increase. Make sure you bring lots of walls. Additionally, higher tier walls grant more taming effectiveness. A tech wall is like kibble for it. Note, a tamed armadillo sucus deals less damage to structures than a wild one to accommodate PvP balance. Now, this is a good, uh, good little tidbit as well, I reckon. So, uh... Won't this creature make the Roll Rat and the Dodicarus useless? Nope. The Armadillo Sucus is a combat slash travel mount, not a gatherer. It can't collect wood or stone. Therefore, it fulfills a different role than the two mentioned. So, it's pretty cool. I do like how it's very similar to a Volvodon from Monster Hunter, but it is an actual real creature as well. These things did actually exist once upon a time. So, let's quickly go over some of these uh, things. Honestly, I like the way that it... Um, doesn't take up the rolls from the Roll Rat or the Dodicarus because they've mentioned that you can't harvest with it. This is a pure combat and traveling mount, which I actually think is really cool um, because you're still going to have a need for a Roll Rat. But obviously this would be pretty easy to implement into the Ark game because they could just use the rig from the Roll Rat and just implement it on the Armadillo Sucus um, and have it roll through the trees and the stones and stuff like that. The rolling in any direction, even jump or rolling, is freaking cool. Because unlike the Roll Rat, it's not very mobile. Uh, so this thing would kind of be more so like a, a free-rigged bowling ball kind of thing, which is awesome. Uh, the Tongue Grapple, I love the Tongue Grapple. Tongue Grapple is awesome. So very similar to like um, Ant Eaters and actual Armadillos, their tongue is sticky to get insects and stuff like that out of the ground and everything. So the fact that it has a sticky tongue and you can use it to roll through everything and even latch onto larger carnivores and knock them away is awesome. Uh, I do like the fact that you can take it underwater and across water. So that's a really cool concept. And the fact that it won't, it'll probably have an oxygen meter, but you probably won't have to worry about oxygen because you'll have your own little airtight pocket in its belly, which is pretty cool. So the Armadillo Sucus, definitely one of those creatures that's really cool. And I do like the taming mechanic for it as well. 
it's very different to what we currently have as well. So I think this guy's really awesome. But let me know what you guys think of this guy down below in the comments. Let me know if you're going to vote for him. But other than that, guys, thanks very much for watching. And I'll catch you in the next one.